that public matching funds, uh, banning outside income, like there's a lot of ethics proposals in front of the legislature this year. Do you need to see, or you or your office, do you guys need to see all of those, or would you see even one of them passing as like a significant win? Ooh, that's an internal strategic discussion. <laughs> um, the governor would like to see all of them passed. That's why we introduced them. Um, now, we've had conversations with the legislature. We continue to have conversations with the legislature, and we hope that there is some appetite to advance some of these proposals. Um, we've been successful in prior years. We have not been able to achieve everything. We've achieved some, not all. And I define that to some degree as success. Some don't, right? Some that engage in this public discourse will say, unless you get everything, it's a failure. Others will say, if you get two or three of these pieces that we think are important, we think that's a huge success. And I think it's in the eye of the beholder. It depends on who the audience is. It depends on who the stakeholder is. We're focused on all of these proposals. We understand their pros and cons. We understand that the appetite in the assembly may be higher for certain pieces than others, same in the Senate. And our job is to negotiate the best possible package possible. Um, we'll wait to see what happens, and uh, the middle of June is our deadline. <laughs>